Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, I will show you how to change file permission in Ubuntu. So, let's get started. Here, I will change permission of a file. For this, at first open the Ubuntu terminal. Now, I will print the permission details of all the files and folder current directory. For this, type ls, then space, then dash l, then press the enter button. Here, we can see that file1.txt and there is no executing permission for owner, group user and other user. Now, I will set the executing permission for owner. For this, type chmod then space then u then a plus sign then x for executing command then space then the file name for which we want to change permission here the file name is file one dot txt here this ch mode command will change the file permission of file one text now press the enter button. Now again I will print the permission details of all the files and folder of the current directory. For this again type ls then space then dash l then press the enter button. So here we can see that file permission of the file1.txt has been changed and the owner has been given the permission to execute this file1.txt file. I will change permission using chmod command of a file which is owned by another user. At first, open the Ubuntu terminal. Currently, I am logged in as SAM user. At first, I will print the current working directory. For this, type pwd, then press enter. This is the absolute path current working directory. Now, I will print the permission details of the files and folders inside the current directory. For this, type ls, then space, then dash l, then press enter button. Here we can see that we have a file named file2.txt and here writing permission is given for group and owner. Now I will omit the writing permission for group user from another user account. Now I am switching to that user account. I have switched to the Shushmit user. Now I am opening the Ubuntu terminal. Here we can see that I am currently logged in as Shushmit user. Now I will change the permission of file2.txt file which is originally owned by SAM user. For this type sudo then space then chmod then space then g minus w then space then the absolute path of the file2.txt file which is for slash home for slash sam for slash desktop for slash file2.txt here this ch mode space g minus w command will omit the writing permission of the group user for the file2.txt file which is owned by SAM user. Now press the enter button after writing this command. It is asking for the password of currently logged in user. Press the password then press the enter button. Now I will print the current permission settings of the file2.txt file. For this, type sudo, then space, then ls, 
then space, then dash L, then space, then the absolute path of that file to the txt file, which is home, then forward slash sam, forward slash desktop, forward slash file to dot txt, then press the enter button. Here we can see that writing permission for the group user is omitted for file2.txt file which is originally owned by the SAMT user. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching.